Hey guys, welcome to the Field of 68 YouTube channel. If you like what you see here, hit that subscribe button and you'll get more college basketball content just like this. Tobacco Road Rivalry. We've seen Duke lose to NC State. I believe it was now 15 days ago. I think it was the third loss in this eight-game miracle run by Kevin Keats. Sweeney, what does Duke have to do to be able to get a little bit of revenge? and get back to the Final Four, John Shire's first Final Four in his second season at the helm. Yeah, look, like, I think the best thing that could have happened to Duke was losing that game, looking back, right? Especially now that they play him again, right? Like, it is a scary game if they hadn't played each other in a while, and it's a rival, and they're, you know, they're free, and Cinderella, and you're, you have to win this game. The fact that they got beat by these guys 15 days ago, they are going to be jazzed up to play this game. I, I think they're going to come out firing. I think, look, it's all about Duke's guards. We've talked about their guards all year long. I think they've been terrific in the tournament. Like, I know it, was, it wasn't was a ton of scoring yesterday or whatever it was against think. Houston, but Tyrese Proctor made some huge plays in that game. Like, it was as, it was as solid. Made, made, had the dagger, yes. right? Yes, Roach hit the huge shot, right? I mean, look, when they played NC State in, in the ACC tournament, Tyrese Proctor, 10 points, 4 for 16 from the field. Jared McCain, 8 points, 2 for 6. Jeremy Roach, 5 points, 1 for 6. Part of that's NC State's defense. They have good, you know, good dudes on the perimeter who are, who are aggressive. But when Duke's guards play well, they're going to cause a lot of problems because Filipowski is going to win, you know, be able to win on the inside. There, he's going to be able to get stuff done against Dr. and and Burns. Like I, I think Duke finds a way to win this game as long as its guards deliver and their guards have played great this March. I have no no reason to believe that they won't play well uh, in, in this setting here tomorrow. And they can afford to have one of them have an off game. I mean, that's the beauty of their, their honestly, their backcourt. They got three good guards. They're all capable of going for 15, 18 points. We've seen it all year. Roach is the veteran that you kind of trust, right? He made the big shot to put him up six the other night. Uh, Proctor has been inconsistent, but you know what? He's pretty good defensively. Like, that's the one thing you can count on with him. And, again, McCain can light it up. So, like, I, I, I just trust them. You know, they weren't great the other night. And, and as I said, they were lucky a little bit. They were lucky. Duke was? Yeah. I, I mean, listen, if Jamal Shedd doesn't go down, I don't think we're talking about Duke. I think we're talking about Houston. Don't you? Probably. Yeah. But, you, I know, mean, the, but the, you need some luck. Yeah, like yeah. I said, I'm not taking anything away from well, I probably am taking a little bit away from him. You're taking more than just taking the biggest win of the tournament. You're taking, You're taking John Shire's biggest win of his career yeah, away yeah, from him. Yeah, I'm just saying. Sometimes you need some luck. He got it. Good for them. Now they got to win this one. Now you you lose this one. This is a disastrous loss. This game will follow oh. John Shire if oh. he doesn't win it. You can't it lose will 100% this one. Follow. Sure, because if you don't. You don't get that many of these opportunities. Mm -hmm. And when you get them in the Elite Eight and you play NC State, it's your rival an 11 team. seed, an 11 seed. You know what's crazy about this right. NC State run? I, I was thinking about this the other day. I think it was the second round of the ACC tournament when they played Virginia Tech. Do you remember what happened at the end of that game? Virginia Tech was up by three and decided not to foul when they were up by three. If Virginia Tech fouls yeah. up by three and it's wins over. that game, it's over. It's over. Like right. NC State They're not isn't here. here. Yeah. Kevin Keats loses three years of guaranteed money. He probably loses his job. Forget yeah. three might, years. Might he's lose, probably out looking for job. another job right and now. And now he's sitting here. Right. All he has to do is beat right. a team that he beat two weeks they ago. Were tied, the four. They were tied with four and a half minutes to go with yeah. Louisville. Yeah. Right. Yeah, right. Louisville. Kenny Payne nearly knocked him out. All right, give and me, here we are. Give me predictions. Who wins? Look, I think Duke wins. I think the shooting luck. Uh, defensively that NC State's had. I mean, look, they've played great. They've earned it, but they have also been very fortunate with how teams have shot against them. Please stop, particularly Marquette. Please stop texting Jim Rue. Please it's stop Duke. texting Jim Rue. This shooting luck defense. Please stop texting Marquette Jim Marquette shot Rue. four for 31. They were so open, you might have made them. Please stop so texting open. Jim Rue. I think Doster would have made more than four out of 31. Doster was make open shots. Yeah, yeah. It, wasn't, it, wasn't, it. it wasn't shooting luck. It was, uh, let's just say that Marquette um, might have choked a little bit. I think that's what it was. <laughs> they got... Choked is the wrong word. I, I'm sorry. Choked is the wrong word. Nerves got the best of them. Yeah, I mean, listen, Duke's got to win this, right? I mean, they have to win this. They have so much more talent upside. I mean, I don't know. Like, I, I just can't see it. But, again, DJ Horn's been terrific, mm -hmm. making big shots. Uh, obviously, Burns is a B 
beast in there, right? Like tough to tough to match up. Like I don't know. It, it, I hope it's a fun game. Like I hope this game goes down to the wire and it's a it's a fun game because we need we need those. I don't I don't think it's going to be a fun game. I think that um, I think that Duke is going to kind of pull away and win by double digits. Yeah. The fun game is going to be the first one. The fun game is going to be the two twenty game tomorrow. Um, Purdue and Tennessee. We can't get two. We can't um, get two fun games. I would love to see two fun games, but I just don't. Don't be that. greedy. The best month of the year is here, which is why you need to know that we are partnered with Bet MGM. We'll be using Bet MGM lines for making all of our picks and predictions, and we'll have special offers for the listeners and the viewers of the Field of 68. If you haven't signed up for Bet MGM yet, you can use bonus code FIELD and you will get up to a $1,500 first bet offer on your first wager with Bet MGM. Here's the best part. All you need to do is deposit and bet $10 of your hard-earned money to get it. This is what you have to do to make it work. Download the BetMGM app and sign up using that bonus code FIELD. Deposit at least $10 and place your first wager on any game. You'll get up to $1,500 in bonus bets if your bet loses. Just make sure you use that bonus code FIELD when you sign up. Most importantly... We have some fun stuff coming up for the rest of the NCAA tournament. Bet insurance tokens, college hoops odds boost, and the thing that I love the most, a nice little parlay boost, as well as a ridiculous array of prop bets for anything that you could possibly imagine betting on. From odds on getting to the Final Four to national championship futures, I'm calling it right now. Bet MGM is the king of the prop bet. So go download the Bet MGM app. Use that code FIELD and sign up today. And while I've got you a quick request, the best way to support the Field of 68 content you get for free is to engage with us. Rate and review the pod in any podcast app. Like and share the YouTube videos that you enjoy. Tell your friends about us. It all helps in a world where the algorithm is king. And now, back to the show. 